I traveled around this great land of ours meeting animals who are actually taking Prozac. Really? And oddly enough, I brought television cameras with me so we can view the tape now. Would you like to do that? Yeah. Would you like great. that? Would yeah. you like to see pets, some animals pets I brought? On, pets on pets Prozac. Pets on Prozac. Wow. Just for you. <laughs> oh, what a good... This is Willie, yes. a dog who loves his log. Yes. Some people think that's precisely his what problem. <laughs> You feel he's fixated on the log. He's very much fixated on the log. He is not looking or enjoying anything else but this. Can you not play with him or, or no. pet him or something? No. You oh. can pet him. You cannot take his log away. <laughs> and this is how he lives life. The dog looked pretty happy to me, but I guess looking happy doesn't necessarily mean you're sane. I kind of take this very seriously. I see that this is not an easy way to live. If you take another dog out into the woods, they would get into the trees and walk and have a good time. Mm -hmm. Willie has to look at his log, stay with his log, and it, he doesn't see the big picture. To expand Willie's horizons, his doctor put him on Prozac, the miracle drug of the 90s. 10 million humans have tried Prozac and its lookalikes to treat their depression and other psychic disorders. Now, a handful of vets are prescribing Prozac to animals. Uh-oh. Get your log, Wills. Get it. Good boy. Good boy. He was wandering the streets of Long Island, and they picked him up. Right. And then I got him, and soon after, he got onto a piece of lawn furniture, and he just pulled the wood off of it. I called my neighbor up and I said, get some wood over here. I need it before he destroys something else. If you saw a human going through life like this, <laughs> he, would be in a he would be in a hospital. He'd be getting shock therapy. I'll tell you a little secret. It's odd that I was, that he came into my life. I have obsessive compulsive disorder myself. Do you really? Yes. Do you wash your hands? What do you No, I've kind of worked through all that. And on a scale to one to 10, I was a two. This is more serious. I mean, on a scale to one to 10, this is a 10. No one can be sure if Prozac will work for Willie. But we'll check back later to see if he's put down his log. This is Tufts University in Massachusetts, where Willie's doctor works. How many different dogs and cats have you prescribed Prozac to? I would think uh, a few hundred. How many animals nationwide do you think are on Prozac? Uh, increasing exponentially, I would say. Dr. Nicholas Dodman is experimenting with using Prozac and not just on dogs. It all seems to be about a natural brain chemical called serotonin. I mean, if you have very low serotonin, you can end up with these people in uh, McDonald's who machine gun to nine people with an Uzi. Yeah. And people who have the ultimate self-directed aggression suicide have very low brain serotonin. A drug like Prozac and Prozac lookalikes is, in, is giving a person more serotonin. Right. Dr. Dodman showed us a tape of some of the ailments he's trying to treat. This is a fly-catching dog, but there's no flies around. That's the difference. And you can hear it snapping in the air. He's an elderly Great Dane and he puts his head behind the curtains, just hangs out. And, you know, <laughs> it looks kind of amusing to see him, uh, you know, looking like a, a sheik. Uh -huh. Some people call it flank biting. Some, call it, some people call it self-directed aggression. Right. We've, we call it self-mutilating syndrome. They start spinning in circles, barking, yapping, chasing their tails. Some of them bite their tails off, you know, Ooh. like the tip of the tail off. I'm just maniacal. These guys are really sick. So Prozac helps with this? Mm -hmm. And then there's Ruby. <laughs> The African gray parrot who keeps plucking out all her feathers. And we just woke up one morning and that was it. The feathers were gone. She became so obsessed with preening and she started to bleed. And we saw uh, Dr. Rosenthal and, and um, she thought it might be useful to, uh, for Ruby to take Prozac. This is Ruby's Prozac and that's prescription. Mm -hmm. This is the instructions they gave you when you got the Prozac. Avoid alcohol products. Well, she doesn't drink. Not at all and use caution when driving or operating machinery. Where does that leave her with flying? Isn't it she, in a sense, actually operating a vehicle by flying? Why don't we give her the Prozac? Want your Prozac, Ruby? <laughs> she seems more silly and she seems uh, more relaxed in general. Maybe too relaxed. Ruby, I got you. Two months later, we revisited Willie to see if the Prozac was helping him yet. Yes, he's a braggable. This looks like pretty good. Boy, he wouldn't really say hello before. No, he won't. Whoa, he won't. now he won't stop. <laughs> so he has a greeting disorder. That's right. <laughs> now, this is Willie after two months of uh, medication. Yep. 
You can't ask for better behavior in a dog than this, can you? What would He's you hope for? Good. He's looking good. He, he learned how to sit and stay, as you can see. No, this looks very normal to me. Yep, he didn't do this the last time. Before, if I did this, he'd want to grab it. And now I see no yeah. interest in this at all, which is great. Yeah. You know what he likes? He's a good boy. He's rear end scratched. Loves that. Ooh. Ooh. He didn't seem to be obsessive compulsive anymore. But could he resist the temptation of a frisbee? What about a tennis ball? Wow, he wasn't fixated at all. I'm impressed. <laughs> Perhaps he really was cured. There was only one way to be sure. Anything here you think of interest to Willie? I think that log's in there. Willie. Willie. What do you think? Look at that. Look at that. Now that's amazing. And did you ever used to offer him a ball when he had the log before? Mm-hmm. But he would never put the log down, he period. He the log. And if a log wasn't around, he'd be swinging from that branch, trying to get a branch in his mouth. Right, so he had a, he was just, he was wood obsessed. <laughs> his name should be Woody. <laughs> Well, then he would be obsessed with children. <laughs> Ooh, yum, 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 yum. Ooh, mm, good log. Hey, can I interest you in a nice log? Which one, Willie? You want the log? He wants it. That, well, well, there you go. This is Willie to me. Can't let go of this. Yeah, I think you should maybe frame it. I think so. With his picture? Nothing will work like this drug, that's for sure. To help an animal. Oh, it would bring tears to my eyes to think that, you know, we can help an animal. Mm -hmm.